Okay, now I'm here with a little guy. This is Mr. Hogan. And there are no runs in the litter. I hate when people say, I see the runs. There's no runs. They're all big babies. Um, his coat is very coarse. So he's gonna be a very chill out dude. Here he is. In fact, we, we've called him a beach bomb or surfer dude or whatever. He's got amazing balance. He actually does really, really well with our yoga. Um, he'll get on this little balance equipment and stuff like that. And he's just, he'll pull himself up and do things that I'm like, oh my gosh, I can't believe he's already doing it. But he does very, very well. He's more of a little observer. What are you saying? I know I can hear you. Uh, more of an observer. So he kind of watches everybody, watch what they do, and do I want to get in or do I not? Which I really like in a puppy because it's one of those because you know they're more of a thinker when they're that way because they're thinking about what they should do as opposed to just going in full force and then like, oh crap, what did I just do? Right? A good boy? Yes, you are. A good boy. I'm going to show me you're sitting. Or you want to get on your, your little board there. Hogan sitting. Hokey, hokey, hokey sandwich. Thank you very much. Good boy. Very good boy, Hogan. Is that good? He's, he takes forever to eat his treats. I mean, literally. Here, please. Hogan, here, please. Very nice. What's next? Good boy. Very good boy. But you can see he's just like real soft and real mild mannered. Um, it's funny because all the boys are this time. They're very, uh, you know, Hogan's the littlest and Luke is the biggest and Oakley's the art, as you saw, or Tanner, I'm sorry, Tanner's the biggest, Oakley's the most sensitive, Hogan is our littlest, and they all have that coarser coat. Now our girls, on the other hand, well, you saw our diva and our party girl, huh? And our middle child and our bookworm, right? Thanks for watching, guys.